Hi, welcome to the Elijah 7000 update. One of the keys about Elijah's life, you know, remember, remember that you have learned that Elijah's life becomes a pattern and a prototype for your life, according to Malachi chapter 3, Mark chapter 9, and Luke chapter 1. It says this, get thee hence and turn thee eastward. I want to dwell there for a minute. Turn thee eastward. Malachi chapter 3, 5, and 6, he will turn the hearts of the fathers to the children. Mark chapter 9, he will turn. Luke chapter 1, he will turn. One of the essential moves of this Elijah 7000 example in your life is that God will create turning points. Turning points that we don't like because we like to see straight. God will move you around the corner because he has the upward view. I want you to understand that when God commissions a turn, in your life, a turning point that you do not expect, do not anticipate, and to your flesh, it seems as though it is a demotion, it seems as though it is a cloud, or it is darkness because you can't see and you don't know. What God is saying to you is that when you turn, I will show you my miraculous power because he turned eastward. Eastward is in contrast to westward. God always, God's ways are not your ways. So despise not the turning points in your life. When you feel that there is a situation, when you feel that there is something in your life that has inexplicably turned around, look for a miracle because the Elijah pattern is that he will turn eastward and then he will turn to Zarephath and then he will turn to Carmel. Turning points don't mean misinformation. It means transformation. So remember, look out for the turning points and see the transformation. Whoa! <laughs>